Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. This is the first one in a long, long time. But, it's not much to do here in the winter, so now we're through that finally. And uh, we are ready to go bass fishing. So today, it is May, and we are going to be hitting the good old reservoir. Going to be doing some shore fishing. I want to do the boat, but I don't have the truck at the moment. It's in the shop getting work, uh, stuff fixed with it, so I can't throw the boat anywhere. So today we're going to be the land warrior, and we're going to go battle the pollen and uh, from the shore. So we'll see what happens. I think it should be a good day. Right now, up in the northeast, spawn is almost, it's, it's, it's like there. It's almost there. They really say end of June, uh, or excuse me, end of May, early June it starts. So we're like, we're, we're right there. Water temperature is finally creeping up. It's getting hot out. Like we had a few days last week uh, in the 80s. So today is a hot day. I think it's right around like 80 as well. So we will see if we can get the job done. I'm gonna go out with two poles. Can probably um, bring up, uh, yeah, I'm gonna bring out a bait cast or a spinner and the good old um, spinning setup with a Senko on it. Oh, the lunker lock Google makes. So uh, yeah, we're gonna roll with that and let's see how uh, this day goes. Fish on, fish on. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Literally, first cast. 2024 hookup. Oh, this gets me back into it. This is fun now. <laughs> I've done it all year. I've been neglecting doing it, been busy with other things, but it feels good to finally get out here. It's actually really cool. I didn't even have time to put the GoPro on yet. I'll show you exactly what I did. If I can get this out of here. There we go. Uh, so, he was actually right out there. I saw him come up in the surface right where the sun hits it, so I pitched in front of him. And uh, first one, there he is. All right, let's let this guy go. Back to the little underworld. Perfect, thank you, buddy. First one in 2024. I see two of them in this corner over here. Let's see if we can pull any of them off. That's what we're using. We have a little gear review mid vid. Let's see what we got here. Uh, where's the, where'd it go? There it is. All right, so. What the hell? There it is. Okay, so we just got a basic Gamagatsu one aught octopus hook. Teamed up with the good old uh, Lunker Log five inch. I believe this is green pumpkin blue flake or something like that. I believe that's what this is. I love the Lunker Logs. It's the go to. Any body of water, if you want to see if there's fish in there throw on a lunker log and you'll find out if there's fish in here it's i just i like the the natural the scent it comes with i don't, I don't add anything to it uh and i just like the flexibility of the worm moves really nice in the water Ooh, little guy almost had it just nibble down a little bit yeah, there's two nice ones over there in the corner i don't know where they went Lure kind of spooked them a little bit, so I'm gonna shuffle back down to the left side. I'm gonna give them some time over there and hopefully linger on back. Fish on. Yeah, that's a nice fish. Look at that one. That's a meaty fish. That is definitely a nice fish. Might have had a bed right there and my pitch run on his head. Absolutely annihilated it. That's a nice fish. Hook right in the upper mouth, right where we want it. That was nice, that was a nice attack. I love, I love spring fishing like this. It's so fun, you get to watch it all happen live. Oh. Hold on buddy, I'm getting you out of here. I'm getting you out of here, hold on. There we go. few pictures. This looks nice. First nice one. I mean, he has a nice gun on him. 
Nice gut. Nice fish, nice fish. Fish on. Oh, this is fun. Ooh, come back over here. I'm stuck in the tree, I'm stuck in everything. There we go. Ooh. Come on, buddy, calm down, calm down, stop spinning. Thank you. I'm thinking this is the male, because the females are always bigger this time of year, because they're all full of eggs and all that, so this must be the male. Pair it up, brother. Ooh. There we go, here's the guy. Not bad, not bad. And we'll take this. First time out this year. Got three on the board, missed one. We'll let this guy go back down. This spot's probably done now. I got both of them out of here. All right. Did you take my worm again? <laughs> I'm going through like worms like crazy. Is it on here? No, you took it again. That bastard. All right, all right, all right. I'm very pleased with making the decision to come out today. I wasn't going to do it, and I'm like, you know what? We got a day off. It's very nice out. Every time, nor usually when I'm off, it pours. So we have a beautiful bluebird sky day today. I'm going to put it to use. We're running out of worms here, so we might be changing tactics to something a little different. I'm not planning on staying out too, too long because allergies are really affecting me today. I'm having a real tough time doing anything right now. I'm like blowing my. Just constant coughing and stuff, which is annoying. But I mean, I mean, hey, hey, if we keep yanking them out here, I might be staying here a little bit longer. <laughs> Definitely looking forward to getting the the small boat out here. That'll be fun. Plus, I'm looking forward to getting the bass boat back onto the uh the lakes but right now we the truck is in the dealership getting stuff done to it so i have nothing to tow anything with so right now the boat is landlocked in the driveway so we're just gonna shore fish for the time being which nothing's wrong with that fishing's fishing in my book a bad day out here beats a best day at, at work so we'll take it Whew. It's definitely hot, especially when you wear the GoPro on your chest and you're in the, I don't even know what they call it. It's like the bra strap, strap, whatever, the, the chest mount one. It just suctions right to your chest. It's, it gets hot real quick. But it funs. Oh, I do see another one. Oh, I see it. It looks like it looks like a nice fish over here. I don't know if he's going to be finicky or not. If it's on, uh, let's see what happens. Let's see if I can pitch it over there. It's funny, I'm just, I got all the new poles. I'm still using this old one because I don't want, I don't want to use the new poles yet on shore and get them like all roughed up in the, the muck. Yeah, I know you say what you want, but that's just what I do. Ooh, kind of spooked him. He's looking at it. We got him. We got him. Fish on. <laughs> that was sick. That was actually really sick. How the hell, what is this like? Am I hooked in his gill? Oh, no, 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 the line's just in there. He's in the mouth. Yep, there it is. Perfect. Right in the seat. Side cheek. Come on, fish. There we go. Thanks, bud. Go back. There we go. There we go. Four. That's cool. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Fish on. Come through this muck here. Flip them up. There we go. Look at this guy. Oh, he can't. I have my worm still. Thank you. I'm going to change. Look at him. Wow, what a day out here. If you go back in. Look at him go. <laughs> Thank you, bud. Fish on. <clears throat> Bit squeak. Oh my gosh, we're just tabletopped over. <laughs> Little guy. Oh, he took my worm. Wow, I'm going through packs out here. Whatever, it's good. It's good, 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 good. There we go. 
Thank you, buddy. <laughs> Look at the little guy. Go get big. Fish on. <laughs> you can't make this up. The worm's going again. <laughs> Look at him. Nice one. Hauling fish in today. This is great. I'm having an absolute blast right now. Only problem is we might be running out of worms. I'll have to be Jerry rigging some other stuff. Go get big. Look at him dart out. That's so sick. Oh, this is so cool. This is, this is my kind of fishing right here. I love spring fishing. That's why I've been kicking myself that I haven't been out yet. Hey, I picked a good day to start today. Picked a good one. I think I have one more left in this pack. Yep, there's one more left in this pack. And I think I got one more full pack. I don't think I have anything else. I didn't think I was going to be going through two packs of Senkos. I think I have some swim baits, which I literally might just rip off the might just rip off the paddle tail and just use those as some Senko style things. See if that works, because these guys are absolutely annihilating this right now. But like I said, this kind of the year they might annihilate anything. So I might be able to just throw on a uh, the paddle tail and to begin with. Since I pulled out two of here, I don't think I'll be getting anything else. Let's throw this out maybe one or two more times here. Then we continue down to the right to the main point where I'm trying to hit. Getting absolutely attacked by horse flies right now, which is pissing me off, but. Ow, on my arm. <laughs> I'm gonna have welts all over, I already know it. All right, made out to the point. Gonna throw a line in, see if anything wants to bite out here. Okay, they do, literally first cast. <laughs> That's a nice one too. These hooks just go there if their mouths are this much harder than they usually are. They're wedged in there. There we go. I don't even know if I have my worm there or not. Did I notice? Look at this guy. Nice guy. Nice fish. That was funny. I'm really like, right at the point, let's see if anyone wants to bite. <laughs> First cast. Appreciate the fun. I love it too. I, I love this. They're like so feisty this time of year. Like, even though he, he's not giant, but he's a good sized one. And then. Like he puts on a good, like, serious, like he fights, it's fun. I'll put something on this ultralight tackle. Oh, I just still do got my worm. Thank you. All right. Break up again. Let's see if somebody else wants to come to the party. Let's see. Can we go two for two? That'd be funny. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like I'm in the jungle right now. Bush is as tall as me. <laughs> fun, fun. I'm going to leave the point. Not a lot of action there. I'm going to shuffle up. Go this way. Go up the little cliff. It's like right there. Try out that for a little bit. If nothing, I'm going to wrap it up. Because we're running out of worms. And my allergies are absolutely kicking my butt right now. I'm sneezing up a storm. My throat... I, it's like... Whew. Whew. It's killing me. I gotta go. But we're gonna give this a few more tries. Plus, man, on the way back, as always, I gotta fish off that bridge again. So, try, try a few more spots. I have like four worms left. Alright, made it to my spot. Look at the beaver actually going down on this thing. He's actually right there in the water. I don't know if you can see him. I'm just come down. I'll show, show it to you. He's absolutely going to town on this tree here. So, you can't see him. I usually have luck with these trees here, so pitch around the Senko around here a little bit, see if we can yank them off. What's that? That's a sunny on it, I see them. We don't want no sunny. This beaver is still like circling around out here. Oh my god, I got stuck. What the hell? I tried setting the hook and went right into this branch, damn it. Try that again.
Is that a bass on it? No, it's a sunny again too. There we go. We got him on. I was shocked how many fish we caught. I don't even know what it is. Eight, nine, ten. I don't know what we're at. It's a great day. It's great when you lose track. Lost the worm again. <laughs> this is funny. There we go. Popped it out of that one. Oh, no, it didn't. Wow. These are like razor sharp. They don't come out. These beaver's still circling around out here. Look at them circling. Here we go, let him go. Another Senko, give us a few more tries. I'm gonna wrap this up. Ooh. Airborne fish, airborne fish. Got another one. I didn't think he was, I didn't even see him. He was in like a three inches of water over here. On the reel back, I just let it dangle. Right, the, right at the base of the water line here. And he smacked it. And I lost a worm. So yeah, we're pretty much gonna be throwing one more. Call this quits, but hell of a day. Throw him back. Thank you, bud. Fish on. This is like absolutely crazy. I've never had it be like a clinic like this in like years. Usually, how could this happen in my tournament last year when I was doing stuff? <laughs> absolutely hauling these out of here. Dang it, he took the worm again. You can't make this up. I probably said that like 14 times in this video. That they took the worm, but he, you gotta be kidding me. Usually they stay on somewhat. I guess not today, whatever. Ooh. Look at him, nice little gut on him. Thank you, bud. Go back down there and get big. All right. All right, job well done. <coughs> Wrapping up. Oh, I forgot I have the hockey. I forgot I have a hockey gear bagger. <coughs> yeah, this sucks because usually I'm used to my nice like five foot cargo bed or cargo bay area. Now I have like three feet. <coughs> Whatever, let me go work. Gotta get some water out of here. But yeah, that was definitely good. We're gonna wrap up first day fishing, largemouth bass fishing this year, 2024, and had a hell of a start. Like I don't even know how I lost track. <coughs> Definitely more than 10. Great day. Got to call it quits. I'm running out of worms, and I'm allergies absolutely killing me right now. I'm like, it's hard to breathe. I'm gonna go home, shower up, clean this all off, and then uh, start editing, editing this video up. So, like always, if you, like, if you enjoyed the video, like, subscribe, leave some comments down below for some videos to do throughout the year. We're down to do anything. Always have a good time. So uh, I will catch you on the next adventure.